Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. And originally, I wasn't necessarily even going to record this. I was going to record it from my own memories. Memories! At the corner of my mouth. Let's see, do we need to, um... We start going to get the proper message to come up. Is that in there already? Dialogue. Wow. What is this? I guess that's not what I'm looking for. What's the... Wow, that's just too take two on this. Well, that's very kind of them. It's nice that they keep doing all this. And if that means that I've got 200,000 for week four, there should be the bonus 200,000 coming up as well. So, woohoo! Man, that looks like two pictures of the T20 to me. Doesn't that look that way to you? I mean, I don't have the tyrant memorized, but you to I'm kill saying there might be somewhat similar. Ah, there we have it. This is Mr. Richards. Yes, the Mr. Richards. There's been a robbery at my studio. My lawyers are busy incentivizing the police. But let's face it, the LSPD couldn't find the, the hole in a donut. Besides, the case, a case like this requires a personal touch. I hear you're the one to call. Come to my studio and take a look. Now, I actually hadn't really planned on on filming this bit of it, recording this bit of it, because, you know, I'm basically, all I'm going to do is I'm going to fire up GTA Men's video on how to find all these things on my phone. And, um, do we want to do the business battle while we talk about all this? And just go from place to place and get the stuff. Um, let's see, is anybody else doing that? It might be low on... We can try it while we're talking about the philosophy of what we're doing here. So, what will be the point of basically reenacting somebody else's video? I mean, you know, GTA men went through the effort of coming up with the locations, and I think he worked with some other people getting the locations, but I mean, that's, that's a tremendous effort. And then I realized... Well, I, mean, I only really want the video for my own, my own memories. You know, here's what the things look like. If I ever want to go back, I can, you know, I can zoom in, I can give it some kind of personal touch. And I'm not going to probably upload this until it's all over with anyway. By the time I get, i got 45 gig of videos I'm going to still have to edit. And the computer's not running well enough to edit them properly anyway, really. So, it really isn't going to hurt anything. I'm not going to steal his thunder. I'm just going, everybody who's going to have seen this video will probably... Why did it do that? I just want... Ugh, I put the wrong button again. And it's up there now. Can I get up there and get that? Surely there's a ladder. Um, can we jump up? No. We need a ladder. There's a ladder. There's only four minutes remaining. Wait, why do we even bother with this? No, I'm not even going to bother. The time... Oh, God, let's get down. Should we, should we try? Oh, we need a gun. What's the other side of the building? <sighs> it's always the time. So by the time I upload this, everybody will have gotten their alien suits. Everybody is going to have done it all. So what the heck? Now I'm just sharing my experiences. And that's... I just screwed that up. It 
it's really it doesn't it takes you out of position here. I mean, I can play front light cycles or basically play it left-handed because I use my right hand to start the signal. Oh, there we go. Okay, I got my right hand involved. Now I do a click and then quick jump over, so we're not. So imagine it's a light cycle. It will take me four minutes just to get this thing open. That's if nobody shoots me in the back while I'm doing it. This is... We're not going to have time to do this. This is a ridiculous... I couldn't get my hand open. Should just lock me out at some point. That is a long path. Now I have to shoot my way through and get stuff here and fly back and... I mean, there may be something right inside the door. This is going to be pointless. Look at... The fact that you have to hit the mouse to get it to start and then switch over. I don't see a lot of people doing these new these new business battles. It's just like, well, that's a pain in the bun, so why bother? And they're the smart ones. That's what we call those people. I hit up. It didn't... I thought we just escaped. Screw it. I can't get back and forth in a minute and a half. I'm just going to put somebody else. I'm just going to let it fail. Go back to what I was going to do in the first place. All right. So first of all, let us go to the S. I'm doing this in a public session, which is exactly how you're not supposed to do it. It was just easier to get into at this point. It was just said, oh, let's go to GTA Online. I didn't bother with anything else. So we'll see how bad an idea that was. There's somebody over there. Do I see a missile coming? I feel like there's a missile coming. Now, maybe because I, I did try to do something, that maybe I'll get like $500 or something or other. You know, five hundred dollars here, a hundred dollars there. Eventually, it adds up to that much. In this game, um, Teddy Jaws Two K. Wow, Two K was like you know twenty years ago. So. Hey, there's a dozer. A dozer you can just grab. Because that would be cool, right? Hit the... Hit the drop out of the sky. Flip, bang. Okay, we almost there. Got that. Hey, 1500. Even better than I thought. Now, here's the funny part. Let's look right here. There's nothing here. Okay. Yes, I've already seen the video ones. But let's walk in. I did start some of my other character. I haven't grabbed anything yet. So we take another look. That video is already up where I started that, but you're not going to see anything that comes of that for quite some time. Looking for clues. This box is a clue. No, there's not too many clues. Exit the office. Now, apparently, according to the video, and I haven't even started up to follow along yet, we go right over here. How's that? Let's, let's get the, um... How is this not there? A meltdown. So that's a... A movie called Meltdown that apparently glows because it's made of something radioactive. Kaching! Return the movie prop. So everyone you find, you gotta go. Boop, boop. 
And then it takes up its place somewhere. Is that it? No. Okay, let's just... Just is what it is. Alright. Exit Solomon's office. And now we're going to do a time warp again as I fire up the video and find out where they go next. Oh, you know, before we do that, I do know if we go in here... Aha! I just want to zoom. It's an alien! Alien action thingy! Action figure collected! Yay! I didn't mean to shoot it. That was... I'm sorry, guys. I tried to zoom instead of shot. You know, it's... So two of 100 action figures collected. All right, well, that's gonna take time. I think we can do the time warp again now. Okay, now, per GTA men, you've got to get to the back office of the vanilla unicorn to get the next one out. He did it by just shooting his way in. I'm gonna see if I could do it the alternate way. He said you could get a, uh, Come on in. Have fun. you know, get a private dance and then that'll get you into the back room. Yeah, and we'll, we'll do the time warp again on some of this. Now I wonder if I can just bypass going, like I'm following Sapphire here to the private room, but can I? Then just sneak past. Do, do, do. See ya, Sapphire. We've got stuff to do here. Where is the... Is this the back office this way? Yeah. There it is. And I think we can... Can we zoom in on that? No, we can't. No weapons available here. That is... I wish you could see what it was. Glowing like that. Some kind of... Award. Now we have to return it. Okay, I think we still have to finish the dance with Sapphire. Something else has popped up on the. Oh, I think that's the Sapphire location. Okay. All right, we'll we'll just we'll just make Sapphire happy and let let's do the time warp again. Okay, so we've got Sapphire as a contact. That's a thing. Okay, next we've got to go to the casino and go to the bathroom. Not because we were just having lap dances from Sapphire. No, that's what the next location is. Again, thank you, GTA Men. I'm going to put a link to GTA Men's video here. Let's go into first-person view because it can't run. You have to just walk... Walk lively. Apparently there's some deal where in first person you move faster. I'm not sure why that is. You have to go all the way to the bathroom in the back, I guess. is Somewhere around. Is it down this? Come this way? Restrooms. Is this the place? Do, 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 do. Nope, this is the other bathroom. All right, we need the other bathroom. Wrong bathroom. There's management. We don't need to go to management. We need a different restroom. Is it this one where the guy's kind of hanging on around the thing? Yes. There you have it. That looks like... I guess it's an Indian headdress. Boop. And we have to bring it back. Come to think of it, I don't think we brought either of those back, did we? We just grabbed them. So at least you can probably get more than one at a time. But we're going to... I think we'll head back now. Make sure they get... How do I get out of here? That's the inside track. Exit! There we go. There we go. There's the girl in the yellow outfit who always watches people spin the wheel because he's living vicariously. There's a car I'm probably not going to win, but you never know. Yeah, never know. Bleh. 
Take the casino. Did they move my car? No, my car is still here. Yeah, good. Scooch. Scooch. Oh, I don't want the valet touching this anyway. Do the time warp again. And here we are dropping back in on Solomon Richards. And hopefully this will tell me I've got three of the... Again, right? Booga, 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 bing. Three ten. All right, so we're good. Dropping props up left and right, and then GTA man has guided us to the offices here in Fort Zanquedo. Should be somewhere. Should be a door. Now where is that? Somewhere around right here, I think. Prepare for criminal damage. That's not worried about criminal damage. You walk in here. This is the door we can walk in. See a light. Ooh, here we go. There it is. The other movie prop. Let's walk right in. Take a movie prop. Movie prop. And run out before anybody notices that I'm not supposed to be here, even though I have a low level clearance. Guess that was in a high level place. Okay, the next one's at the edge of the altruist camp. So obviously missiles are gonna be required. Because they're very they're very hostile folk. And we probably need to soften this up, and I think it's right on the edge up here. Just hit that one and that one. I don't think it can destroy the movie prop. There is movie prop. There we go. Right there. All right. Let's just cut engines. Can we get it with the car? I don't think so. Yes, I'm putting the rock. Okay. I think. And there it is. That's a, some kind of... What the? It's like a guy with a dog in his mouth. I don't freaking want to know. Dude, I don't want to... I don't want to... No. Oddly enough. See you guys. I made it out of there alive. And they didn't even seem to, be, seem to be reacting to me, which was kind of odd. But, oh well. Okay, so this next one is supposed to be right here. Right across from Route 68 uh, Clubhouse here. There it is. And Weenie Hut Jr. are moving nightclub goods. I'm okay with that. That looks like some kind of bust maybe of uh, Solomon himself maybe of somebody else does it matter that should put us roughly halfway there then next according to GTA man we go to the alien camp here the we welcome you aliens and we had a lot of paint which is bad for the environment camp okay so you up here up at the top here We're supposed to be something. Okay. Oh, look at that. And of course it's an alien head. Is that an entire suit? 
And it looks like just ahead. Are we recording? Yeah, we're recording. Okay. Making sure we're recording. And there's some people hanging out. Don't mind me. I'm just taking an alien head. Uh, I should probably return some of these because if I get blown up, I think I lose them all. They can be stolen from me. Okay, let's see how this works out. Dude, does this bring me up to seven? There we go, seven out of ten. Now the next couple are a little bit dicier because you have to drive a vehicle back, but I think we're better off doing that in a closed crew session. Let's do that. Now, normally I would take the limousine up to Lita Bay, but what we want to do is we want to have an event trigger. So I've grabbed my Swift Flying Bravo and I'm heading to the area roughly where my free arcade is. And we're gonna see, it's somewhere up at Polito is where the one, the globe or something will spawn. The last two have multiple spawn locations, and I'm gonna try one of them. I'm not gonna go through all of them because GTA Man has already done that, and there's a link in the description. So, what we're gonna do, if I remember, I'll try to put an eye in the sky somewhere on the line in this video as well. You've already probably gotten that, but what I'm gonna do is I'll just, again, Describing my experience of the whole thing, and we're just recording that for posterity or posterior or something. I'm also kind of testing out my system here a little bit to see if I still have the problem with my voice slowing down, all kinds of pops and bleeps and bloops cutting in and out. This is really annoying, as far as that's concerned. I don't know what's happening with my my recording possibilities here, whether the hard drive is just really packing in at this point or what. But we'll we'll figure out over time. So somewhere up here, as we swoop in, there's supposed to appear a little blue dot. Once we find it. It's supposed to be a truck with, with like this globe on it. Somewhere up here in Paleto. Now I don't know if there's certain times it spawns or something like that. Might have to fly around a bit to get it to spawn. I don't know. What's that little H? That would be a little blue dot, but is there an H now? What's with the H? Yee, yee, this isn't going well. Land it! Good, alright. That's gonna blow the propellers at some point. That's just, apparently, somehow my, why are there H's on stuff? There's an H there, an H there, why does it say H? Does it always said H and it's, I've never noticed before? Alright, let's get some wheels to cruise around in. While we do the time warp again. Okay, apparently you can't just cruise around the blocks and try to get it to, uh, to spawn. You gotta really be going a good distance. Why are all these bulldozers here? Bulldozers all over the place. But it's, uh, you have to go a good distance so you can let the game spawn the things in. I'm not sure if cruising around is going to be adequate. We might have to get another helicopter. We can always drive and get a helicopter. And truth be told, I'm actually going to have to do, despite the fact that I just made a video. I mean, it will be months ago that you've seen it. 
but uh, <laughs> this made a video where I said I don't want to idle anymore. I think it's probably going to be easier just to idle this and then grab a helicopter and then go back out and look. I, I am running out of time here on my normal day of bopping around here of, of, of gameplay. I'm running out of time. And so, there's that. We'll have to continue this up later in the day. But this night chick's fun. I like it. Okay, I guess we really should do the jump, shouldn't we? we got the momentum. Alright, let's do the jump. And then we'll do the time warp again. Here we go. And... Pop us home! Yeah! Bang! Woo! Just made that. Okay, so lots of time has passed. I mean, like a lot, a lot. Hours. Let me see, do we have music going? Not so far. I thought, well, let me grab something a little bit more visually interesting than the. Uh, and then the Akula that I'd normally grab for getting around the map. And of course it's foggy, but all we need to do is fly in. And I cut my speed here so it'll float. I'm going to helicopter mode, so to speak. We just want to give the, the game enough time to spawn in the missing relic here. Because it's apparently, it's not a fixed position. Well, I mean, this particular one is a fixed position, but why is it, why is everything so fogged out? I mean, a close crew, so it can't be modder. Is a specific weather that we're running into? I don't know. Okay, there it is. Gear down. This is going to be a bit tricky because of the limited visibility, but. Okay, this is not going well. Up, 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 more power. I didn't know I was coming down that fast. Um, I'm basically outside the, 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 the CEO in Pajama's house. So at least it's, uh, we'll know exactly where to go. Okay, see, that's the thing. Hey, guys. Excuse me, I don't want to hit the thing. Losing the cop shouldn't be that big a deal. It's only a one star. And we do have some places to run. Come on. Come on. Let's lose that star. Let's take a look while we're looking there. There's a globe. So apparently this is a globe from his office. Gas it. Around the bend. Down the road. And away. And we're golden. All right. I just realized it's probably going to be somewhat problematic to get back to, uh... 
of that particular plane. We'll have to call it in and drive there or something along those lines. See, though, this one you can't... Yeah, I can't pocket it and then get a couple other things. This one, you have to drive the whole car back right now. I might go the lazy route here and just call in a, you know, we'll, let's CEO it up. Call in a buzzard. And then fly around for the other ones. Obviously, you can see why it's best not to do this in a public session, because you're just so open. Right now, Martin. Every griefer and modder in the world will be blowing you to smithereens here, whether they want to take the stuff or not. You're just too wide open a target. They have an interesting model that they got going here. I mean, that's... There's some effort put into this. They have a bit of variety. Some of them are just simple packages. Some of them are like so. They're just, you know, fancy dancy find a vehicle, bring it back kind of things. I mean, how much, how much of GTA is Fed Quest? I mean, it just really is. It's just you go, you find the stuff, you bring it back. You go, you find the stuff, you bring it back. You make the stuff, you sell it. I mean, it's all its all just a driving game, really. With some shooty-shooty stuff built in. We fly over the hill. This will leave us with two more things to get. I know a couple of the locations, but I may have to go back to the GTM and video. Because you got the Epsilon building, you got the Kroger building, or whatever they call it, but the building up at the top of the hill that's the site of one of the business battles. I want to say that um, Lester's factory plays a part in this too and as long as we could get the stuff to trigger then we're golden it's currently the 19th I only have six days to do this which again if you haven't done it you probably are not going to be able to by the time you see any of this but at least you can participate in a vicarious way by watching what's here and, and say, well, gee, you know, $250,000 in an ugly suit, probably not going to change your life. That's not life-changing, you know? It's, but I'm still going to go through with it. Da -da -dun 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 -dun. Hello. I'm here. Wait, where do I have to drop this off? Here's the I place it to park it or oh here we go. It's a drive it in kind of thing. Okay. So eight to ten. Now we need our we need I can't request it I can't request my personal vehicle because it's a big uh, too suitable from a road but you give me that's gonna give me the car I say return your personal vehicle to storage you're not using. And now I can at least uh, call up my Tula. Tula Rula Rula. 
Or it's gonna be part. A little bit far away. I think we're gonna need to depend on the kindness of strangers. Okay, excuse me. Thank you, I gotta go get to my airplane. I'm just making people angry all around, aren't I? What's going on, my dude? Stuff is going on. I'm like, people are all upset. It's just a Zion. There's just a, you know. I'm not too worried about the, uh, the star here. I'll... Can't, you gotta be kidding me. This thing will go down there? Go down there! Okay, we lost the, the star before we even got... We lost the star as we lost the fender. Okay, dude, you can find your car on the beach. There you go. See, I'm not gonna keep it on you. I'm just gonna get in my aircraft. Actually, let's... Get back into airplane mode. Turbo! Gear. Now we're approaching. Let's go slow here a little bit. The next location. We might have been too close to it to get it to spawn in. I'm not sure. This is one option. I don't know if there's a frequency issue here either. Okay, let's loop downtown. I'm not exactly sure where the Epsilon building is. I roughly remember. Roughly, it's like... There it is. Unless that's a drug deal. Is that a drug deal one? Do we spawn in a drug deal? I don't really care about the drug deals. Yeah, it's a... Well, I don't know. I've never seen one with a Patriot before. Well, you got a good place to, to land. Nah, it's a drug deal. I don't care about $10,000 in a drug deal. I had to get the plane again. You do your druggy druggy thing things. Hopefully it's not like you only have one blue dot on the screen at a time, you know? I want to say... That might have been it there. I mean, I think we might be stuck because of the... Uh, maybe there's a one blue dot rule. Hmm. Well, let me look, do the time warp again, and we'll see what else we can find. I think that blue dot, having that other blue dot there, having the drug deal going on, it's it's taking up the same position in memory here, I think, as the, uh, what I need to have spawn, so that's a problem. I mean, I think the drug deals are going to be forever, but...
No, I really I don't even want to be involved with you. But I've got to get this truck out of the way here. I gotta clear this event so that I can do my event. So now I gotta do this crap. Alright, well. <laughs> that was nice. They just freaked everybody out and they all crashed into each other. Turn this way, behind the police. Police, release me. No, we're not going that way. I'm driving right past the police station. I don't know a lot, but I know that's not a good plan. Yeah, a little Patriot fun. And we drive right into a police car. Just teleports in front of us. We're just gonna drive. Usually with a one star, they don't try that hard. Seems like a pretty quick Patriot. Patriot's not a quick machine, and this is this is the difficulty of trying to get this. Mission done. Well, that's good. You drive far enough, close enough to it, eventually you get, just get cut your slack. And okay, now this time I'm not gonna just mess around trying to go through all that. Register as a CEO. Give me the Bazaard. Instantaneous helicopter. Okay, now we need to find some locations here. I think we're quite close enough. To Lester's garage. Which, no, I don't know off the top of my head exactly where that is. It's not down here. I mean, we have to swing up. I think. I want to say it's on this back end of things, but. Has been a while. There are a few locations where we can just pull a dot in. You don't have to be hyper close, you just have to get close enough to get it to happen. We might end up giving, uh, more hits to GTA, man, as I go look up what... Isn't it down this way? Yeah, there's L for Lester. Remember Lester's... You mentioned something about Lester's Garage, but that might not be one of the, uh, locations. You didn't mention if you're down by Lester's Garage, take it all the way back to... Because it doesn't always spawn at each location. It's just not like just a matter of where it will come up. So we've, we've vacated the area from downtown. Uh, looking, let's, let's go back up to the to this center here. I want to say we're Going past the Epsilon somewhere in there. Don't you know your Epsilon? No, no, not really.
to be fair, I'm really just mostly looking to get this done and give this game a break. I'll see more than enough of it while I'm doing editing. Come on, baby, give me a blue dot. Blue dot time. <sighs> okay, I think it's time warp again time. Okay, there's the Epsilon building. Right next to where I parked my Tula, so ironically. I guess we weren't triggering that in with the other, you know, it was interfered with by the other thing. We may as well, oh, is it a point to get in the tool? We got a helicopter. Your style, but... Okay, let's give it a little distance and then come back in. Haha! -ha. Right, all the way other side, I came back this way, now we've got one. Are we recording? Are we recording? Don't know what it's going to be. It could be one of a couple other things here. The guys around here? Yeah, there are. Doink. And it's the mummy's coffin or whatever. That's the. Uh, we gotta drive. The mummy's coffin. I was gonna try and drive off into the hills there. And I just realized there's concrete. Oh, here we go. Totally doing the off-road avoid the cops thing. This van is not cooperating. And we're totally cut off. We have to do the off-road thing. This looks relatively smooth. The doors have at least slammed shut, so we have that going for us. Okay, losing the comps. And we've lost the comps. <coughs> and... Oh, yikes. Come on. Okay, we don't have to go up that one. We just have to go up here. Turn around. Ignore the purple line, because we don't need to go to the purple line. We just need to go... Now, I think from what GTA men was saying, like, because this is... we've gotten it from here, then the Epsilon location is now... Something we don't have to worry about. The, the last one's going to be at one of the other locations, which would be either Lester's Factory or something else. i got to look it up. I will be hitting so many times I'll be hitting his video, but... Technology. We's had it. We's got that going for us. We zip this down for our second to last thing here. Let's just stop for a moment. And can we can we look at it better a little bit? Do you think comment up your nose?
How about the V button? Can we change to a... Then, oh, there you go. Eh. It's a money. But who's your daddy? That's really what you gotta ask is... It's a time-consuming thing. I don't know that I'll, I'll record the whole effort for doing it all over again for this, the CEO in pajamas. So I think you're going to get the gist here. I know I'm a tough guy. You can't just think you're a tough guy. You have to know it. You got any doubts? Your tough guy status ain't gonna be there. Delivery. Special delivery. 9 out of 10. Okay, now. Need to do the time warp again while I recollect and figure out what's next. Okay, so the, the course and the, uh, the Epsilon are tied together for the mummy. So now all we have to do is find the tiger rod. Which again, is either at around Lester's factory somewhere, or down at that, that street market where I always end up driving through and trying not to run people over. I forget what mission is on that. So let's see, let's go for, well, it should have an L, right? Let's go for the L. For the L of it. Yeah, right there. I was close. Going by just location, I didn't even look for the L. I was nearly on the L. Let's do go to the L for the L of it. Not spawning at the L, no. Hmm, it's the other one. We have to find the, the market. Let's do the chain warp again. Ah, uh, DTA men, you're such an entertaining, informative man of mystery. Come on, baby, spawn in. In the right spot? It should be right in the... Oh, there it is. There's the market. Hmm. That's still not getting the blue dot. Let's... Apparently you really have to give it a lot of distance. Let's shoot to the other side of the map here. Then come back to it. See what happens. I don't know if there's a timing element to it either, but we'll, we'll figure that out. Yeah, if you will heck with it. While we're doing this, let's get killed. No, I don't want to get killed. Let's abandon the fragile buzzard. Get back in the up armor Tula. And the two locations of the Tiger Rug are really close to each other, so I mean, you know. We should be able to be good here. Hmm. I just cannot seem to get this to spawn. And this is one of the locations. I'm having no luck. I hate to say this, but I might just idle the heck out of it again. Come back into the session at a later point. And see if I can get it again. Maybe it's a time of day thing. I don't know. Maybe they just make you wait on the last one because... Rockstar. Nicely done. Okay, definitely time to do the time warp again. Anyone else find this picture kind of funny? It's like the spies over here like, I am going to stab you. And the demo man's like, I'm going to shoot a grenade in your face!